Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the closing night of the Israel Film Center Festival. I'm Isaac Zablocki. Thank you, thank you. I'm assuming you're applauding the festival and not me. I am the uh, director of the Carol Zabar Center for Film here at the Marlene Morrison JCC Manhattan. And thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Who has been here for other screenings this week? Oh, wonderful. And you came back. Good. Um, it's always a good sign. Um, thank you for joining us. Thank you really to our audiences for being a part of this this week and taking a part and sometimes asking the best questions. Um, I want to give a big thank you to all of our partners who have been um, uh, been a part of this this week. Um, for this screening specifically, AICF, the America Israel Cultural Foundation. Thank you so much. <laughs> Lauren's not even listening as I'm giving her organization a plug. Um, tell her later. Um, I want to give the biggest thank you to the amazing um, Film Center team here. To um, the lo They did everything, everything. <laughs> they make this happen in so many ways that you can't believe and um, really are living and breathing this whole program. And I couldn't be more lucky to work with such amazing people. Um, Juliette Kleitz, who's here. <laughs> Caroline Calandro, who's here. I finally pronounced her name correctly. Sarah Rosen. <laughs> Ryan Botita took your tickets outside. Our amazing AV team, Sam's in the box office, Sam Brunswick. And many more here at the JCC, the entire institution and our leadership who help make this possible and allow us to to make, uh, to make bring this festival. Um, we had a... R Folks, our security is here. Um, thank you to Sean who gave us great security this week even though we didn't need it. Um, we celebrated Israeli cinema here this week. We reminded people that Israel goes beyond the headlines. And there's stories, there's nuance, there's contradictions, there's love, there's family, there's, there's really a whole world. Most, in, most importantly, there's creativity. Every film was more creative than the next, and that brings me to tonight's film. We're really proud to present here the, this is the American premiere, right? Of, uh, or, or close to it, of Milky Way by Maya Kenning, and we're really proud to have Maya with us here tonight. We've had some of her past films, but this one really is another film that just shows Israel's creativity as it takes a story that is, that is, is such a, in some ways, I think a, a little bit of a criticism of Israeli society and a look deep into Israeli society, maybe a satire of Israeli society, and at the same time shows the detail and the, and the love from within. Um, it's a story of motherhood. It's a, um, a you know, a, a little bit of, uh, of um, a futuristic story, one might say, but I think it's very much in the now, and especially at this moment, I think thinking about motherhood in Israel is something that could be emphasized enough. Um, after the screening, Maya's going to be um, in conversation with uh, Caroline Calandro here. And please stay for the Q&A and be a part of that conversation as well. Um, for now, please silence your cell phones. Um, keep your phones in your pockets and don't text anyone till after the screening, please. And please join us also. We do films year round. I'll, I'll highlight that last year during our Israel Film Center Festival, we screened the film June Zero. That's having finally a release. It was supposed to be released in October. They decided to postpone um, till June, and um, it's having a release um, um, end of June, and we're going to be hosting here multiple screenings. So tell your friends, join us, and thank you so much. Enjoy the film. Thank you. 